The spawning pink salmon didn't seem terribly exciting, so Blair put us in his float plane and flew us off for a late afternoon sojourn to another beautiful Canadian river valley. This time, I would have some luck. What's the game plan, Blair? Well, this would be a good spot, Graham. You can see the, the main river, the Wakeman River, with the silty water, is meeting its tributary right here. Underneath, the fish feel safe. Okay. They get under there, they feel safe. If the water's not too clear, we'll start over here. We'll throw the lures. You'll notice the silver, the bright red, antagonizes them. Bounce it along the bottom as much as you can. The fish should be sitting right out there. You know, standing here in a river in Canada feels a little bit like standing in some of the rivers at home. The only difference is you don't get the bears coming out at home. And uh, I don't know how often the fishing action is like this, but this is absolutely amazing. And also it's the variety of fish in terms of variety of salmon that help make this feel just that little bit different. We've been here five minutes. And uh, we've got to get back, fly back before dark. So we're going to get half an hour in this river and it'll be interesting to see how many fish we get in that half hour. Blair's just dropped two. All we're doing is bouncing the spoon along the bottom as Blair mentioned briefly before. And the fish are sitting right down there and fingers crossed, bang. going on here mate. Hey that's a bloody nice fish. That's a beauty. It's a silver salmon. Is it? Not in the column in the state we call them coho. Come on, come on. How long would these fish have been in the river, Blair? Uh, this one looks by its colouring, looks like it might have been a week or two. See, it's got a little bit of dark on it. Gee, that's not a bad fish, is it? It's getting close to the trophy. Oh, watch out, mate. <laughs> <laughs> getting close to the trophy. That is a goodie. That's not too enough. <laughs> we'll bring him up on the bank here. Get him up, mate. Get him up. Get him up. Yes! All right. Thank you. That is a blooming beauty. There you go. He did wrap himself up. So he got too. himself wrapped so he couldn't breathe properly. Oh, I don't mind, mate. I'll have him. <laughs> <laughs> Great stuff. So, what sort of salmon is now it? If you take the hook out of his mouth. Yeah. That's a silver salmon. Yeah. Okay. You can see the spawning color on him. We could keep them, but you're allowed one a day. Oh, mate, I don't want so to keep now, them. There, there. There's your challenge. Just, just, let the, wait, 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 let's just let the viewers have a okay, look. That's a male. See the way the hook, nose is hooked over? Yeah. And a little coloration on him. That means he's been in the river about two weeks. Yeah. Uh, that's a trophy. That's a close to 18 pounders. Anything over 20, we consider a trophy salmon. Oh, I'm quite happy with that, mate. Okay, that was. Uh, that took a long time to get the first one. Let's go with the second oh. one. Took okay. a long time? Yeah. That was cast number two. There you go. <laughs> 